Hey guys, in this video, I wanted to talk to you and show you guys the plan and tell you a little bit about the cell phone plan that I used to save over $50 a month on my bill. So if you are new here, guys, my name is Susan Velez. On this channel, we talk about making money, saving money, investing money, and taking care of our health in our pre-retirement years so that we can catch up for retirement, especially if you are late to saving for retirement like me. So guys, I actually just dropped Verizon this past weekend and signed up for visible and i want to tell you guys about my huge savings especially if you've been in the market for trying to find a new cell phone provider i know in the last couple of videos i talked about going with mint mobile versus visible however after doing some due diligence guys i decided to go with visible and i do have my referral code up here guys you'll see it up here on the entire video and that's because if you sign up using my visible you're not only helping me but you're helping yourself as well too because what will happen if when you sign up using my referral code you will save twenty dollars on your first bill meaning that instead of paying twenty five dollars to get started with your plan you will sign up and pay five dollars now this is for the visible basic not the visible plus guys you will sign up for five dollars instead of 25 and i in turn will save um on my next bill so instead of paying 25 on my next bill i will pay five dollars so we're both getting a twenty dollar discount for you using my referral code now before you sign up guys i want to tell you a little bit about why I think that it's such a good plan and let you know whether or not I'm happy. So first of all, the visible plan is owned by Verizon. They run on the uh, Verizon towers, you, meaning that you're going to get the same 4G, 5G network that you use right now. The only difference is that you're paying less for it. And they do say that if times are busier, you they might throttle your plan versus somebody who is actually on their Verizon plan. Now that said, I have only been with Visible for a little bit over a week. Um, I did sign up for the free trial and gave that trial a chance before I actually ported my number over from Verizon and saved. But however, when you look at the savings guys, you can see my last bill was a little over $75. And when I started with Verizon, I was paying like, I believe it was like $95 a month for my bill, just my bill alone. So after doing some research, I decided to go with Visible. So how happy am I with the service right now? So as I said, I haven't been with them very long, but I have been with them enough to give the trial a chance. And then also I've just signed up with them about a week ago. And guys, I am so happy with the service. Not only am I happy with the savings, but I've noticed that the service itself is not any different than what I have. So if you are on the Verizon plan right now, or you are using a Verizon network right now, then chances are you're going to get about the same service that you get right now with your Verizon plan. The only difference is, like I said, if during the busiest times, you probably will get throttled a little bit more. And one of the workarounds that I've read about or learned about, if you do use a lot of data, is that you use a VPN. Now I do have a VPN. I, I purchased it during Black Friday last year and I have been using it to watch and listen to YouTube videos and audible books when I am at work. I haven't noticed a slowdown and I did during the trial guys, I tested it out without a VPN and I didn't notice a slowdown. That said, if you are downloading or streaming videos or watching uh, Netflix or doing all kinds of stuff like that, you may notice a difference. I don't do that stuff on my phone, so I can't tell you how it's going to affect you if you do sign up with Visible. That's just something that you have to test out, whether you need to invest in a VPN or whether or not Visible is not the right plan for you. So like I said, guys, the reason that I changed was I was tired of paying $75 a month. I had called Verizon several times to ask them if they could lower my bill. They did finally lower it a little bit. It was like $10, $15 from what it was previously. And that was about it. And I was still paying $75 a month, which in my opinion, for my own line, one line on Verizon plan is a lot of money to pay. So when I found Visible and Mint, guys, I kind of did my due diligence. And the only reason I didn't go with Mint was because Mint, when you sign up with Mint, guys, you have to sign up based on gigabytes, meaning that the lowest plan is like $10 a month and then you get five gigabytes, then you get five gigabytes of data that you can use throughout the month. 
Well, like I said, guys, I like to use a lot of data. I watch a lot of videos. I watch, uh, I listen to YouTube podcasts. So I'm constantly on my phone. Now, when I'm at home, I am on the Wi-Fi. But however, when I go to work or I'm driving, I listen to podcasts and I listen to Audible, which all use data. So I didn't want to constantly be worried about whether or not I'm using my data, if I'm going to go over and then have to upgrade to another plan or buy more data, I didn't want to do that. So when I found Visible and I saw that it is unlimited data, unlimited text, and it's all for $25, you could get the Visible Plus plan. They say that a lot of people say there is a difference on the speed versus the Visible Basic versus the Visible Plus. I haven't noticed a difference, guys. Like I said, I did sign up for the visible plus, or I did sign up for the basic visible plan because I'm trying to save the most money possible. So for $25, I haven't noticed a huge difference. Now that said, when I do visit a site that I used to visit on my visible plan, you can tell a little bit of a difference on the lag. It does take a little longer to get to the actual site, but it's not a huge difference, guys. So it's not a deal breaker for me. If it is a deal breaker for you guys, then consider going with the Visible Plus, which is $45 a month. And you can still sign up using my referral code. It's just you're going to pay more than $5 when you do sign up because you're going to be on the higher plan. So just keep that in mind, guys. So, so far, like I said, I've only been with them for a little bit of over two weeks with the free trial, if you count the free trial, and I am very happy with it. So, like I said, if you are currently on the Verizon plan, then I would consider going with Visible if you're trying to save money and you're just trying to be more fr and more frugal and more conscious of how much you spend on your bills. If you are currently on T-Mobile or AT&T, another network, I am not sure how Visible would work for you. However, like I said, guys, they do have a free trial on how you can get started. And I'm going to share with you guys how to get started on the free trial because I did do the free trial before I ported my number over from Verizon. Now, that said, guys, if you are the type of person who likes to go into the store, just know that Visible is a completely online service, meaning that you can't go into a store to talk to anybody on the visible plan. You have to do everything online. But guys, in this day and age, everything is moving to online. So if you are not comfortable with doing something online and you still find yourself going into the Verizon store to do, to take care of stuff, then visible is not likely going to be the right plan for you guys. Me, I prefer to do stuff online. That's why I bank online. I do uh, my cell phone online. And I even do bill pay online. There's not a lot of places that I prefer going in anymore because now everything can be done pretty much online. So just keep that in mind if you are thinking about switching over to Visible, that it is completely online. So now I'm going to take you guys to the computer, show you guys how to get started with the free trial so that you can give it a try, guys. It, they do offer a 15-day free trial so that you don't have to cancel your current carrier or your service right now, your service provider right now, you actually just sign up for a free trial and you can toggle between your primary carrier and then the visible plan and kind of see the differences, see if you'll be happy with it. And then after the free trial, that's when you can decide whether you want to migrate over to visible or you want to stay with your current carrier. It's completely up to you guys. And there's no loss, in my opinion, doing the free trial is definitely worth it just to kind of compare and see what you're getting and see whether or not if you would be satisfied with visible before you take the jump and move to visible. So let's go to the computer. I'm going to walk you through on how to get started. All right, guys. So before I get into my visible account and show you guys my plan and how to get started with the free trial, I want to share with you guys why I decided to go with visible and drop Verizon. So this is my a snapshot of the bills that I paid since January. And I have been with Verizon for over three years. And I just kind of want to show you guys a snapshot of how my bills have progressed and why I decided to make the move to Visible. So as you can see, in January, I was paying $87.38 a month. And then in March, my bill automatically went up without me doing anything. And the reason that it went up, guys, is when I got on chat with Verizon, they had told me they had added some features that were not going to benefit me and not make my life any better. But yet my bill went up automatically to $93.10. So I got on chat with them, asked them if there was a way that they could lower my bill. 
and they did they lowered it to $75.56 and I'm not sure why it was $71.69 in April but this was what I was paying every month before I actually went to visible so you can see that I was paying $75.56 on a monthly phone bill and this was just for my phone guys this is just for one month so Verizon if you have family members on your phone yes you get better deals than somebody who's has just one phone on a plan so I decided to go with visible and I'm going to show you guys why I decided to and show you guys how much I'm saving now that I dropped Verizon so here I am guys inside of my visible account you can see it's visible by Verizon as I said visible is owned by Verizon so if you are on the Verizon plan right now and you get decent data or you have good service chances are that visible is going to be a good service for you and you're not going to notice a huge difference in the type of coverage that you get but I'll show you guys how to check to see what type of coverage you'll get in your area if you decide to go with visible you can see right here guys that I just signed up and my new phone bill plan is now $25 so it's dropped from $75.56 to $25 that I'll will be due on August 4th now I want to show you guys when you do use my referral code guys because I have a referral code on top you've seen the referral code the entire time then you will actually get a discount on your first payment when you first sign up you'll see that instead of paying $25 I paid $5 to get started with visible and that's because I use somebody's referral code online so when you do sign up guys you will get your own referral code that you'll find right here in the referrals and you'll see that you'll have your own referral code and mine is 3sdc6ql and this is the code that you'll want to use to get twenty dollars off so not only are you getting twenty dollars off for using my referral code but i'm also getting twenty dollars off so we're both saving twenty dollars on our visible plan so that's the reason that I think that it's so important to use somebody's referral code because you save so much money on your first bill plus you get your own referral code or your own referral link when you get started that you can share out with family and friends and help them save on their bills as well too so like I said if you are trying to get started and seeing whether or not visible is the right plan for you come over here to my visible plan use this referral code and then you can kind of come over here and you can see that it has different plans and then under the plans uh, section just try visible for free now before you do that guys I recommend uh, checking out right here where it says see our coverage click on that type in your address and it will show you what type of coverage you'll get in your area now like I said it does run on the Verizon networks so you're gonna get 4G and 5G on the Verizon using the Verizon networks so if you are currently on Verizon you should be fine and you should be able to get the coverage now I do live in a rural area and I am still getting really good coverage the coverage has not changed from the type of plan that I had on Verizon the only thing that's really changed is that I am paying less money and I have noticed a little bit of a difference when on speed wise when I am trying to access um, something online but it isn't a deal breaker for me guys it's not like I'm waiting forever or it's not like dial up if you if you were around in the 90s when you saw the dial up and it took forever to get online it's not that slow but it is a little bit of a difference with Verizon I was able to just get on without any waiting with visible you do have to wait a little bit but it's not anything that's going to be a deal breaker at least if you're looking to try to save money so once you find out whether or not that the coverage will work in your area you can see right here you can try visible for free so you want to come over here you'll want to follow three these three steps come over here to this link right here where it says compatible and you can see let's see if your phone works on our network choose iOS or Android and input the type of phone that you have it'll tell you whether or not you your phone will work on their network and then after that guys it's going to ask you to download the app on your phone and then from your app you will actually start your free trial and you have 15 days to decide whether or not you want to continue with the 
plan, the visible plan. And then you can choose between either the visible basic or the visible plus. Now, if you're looking to pay just the $5 to get started per month, then you'll want to opt for this visible because with the visible plus guys, depending on when you're watching this video, guys, they do have a summer trial where you can sign up for the visible plus for $25 a month. It's regularly $45 a month. And if you use the referral code guys, you're still going to be paying more than the $5 startup fee. So if you want to just try the visible basic and then you realize later on that you need the visible plus, you can always upgrade. I did contact chat and you can upgrade or downgrade between the two plans. So just keep that in mind. There's no reason to get started with the visible plus. I think that pretty much everybody will be fine with the visible basic. If you do stream a lot and you find that you're constantly being throttled, what I recommend doing is getting a VPN. I do use a VPN, although I've been listening to Audible, listening to Spotify and watching YouTube videos without getting throttled yet. But if you are constantly online and they are starting to throttle your your coverage or your data, then you'll want to make sure that you have a VPN. That way you can overcome the throttle issue. So anyway, guys, I just wanted to show you guys how to do this. And like I said, I would greatly appreciate it if you use my referral. You're going to get $20. I'm going to get $20 off and it's a win-win. And like I said, I have been with Visible for a, about a week now, a little over a week now, and I really am happy with it. I will keep you updated and let you know after I've been with them for a little longer to see what other issues if I am facing in other issues right now I'm very happy with the savings that I'm getting I was able to go from $75.56 a month to $25 a month so I'm saving over $50 on my cell phone bill so anyway guys let me know down in the comments below do you think you're going to give visible a shot and if so are you going to go with the visible basic the visible plus or are you pretty happy with your cell phone provider let me know what you think i'm always looking for ways to save more money and if you went with another carrier guys let me know what you think about them because as i said i was going to go with mint but i decided not to worry about my data because i really like that both of these regardless of whether you're on the visible basic or the visible plus they both have unlimited data talk text and hotspot so anyway guys if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up click on that subscribe button so that you can be notified whenever i put out a new video and until next time guys i will talk to you later have a great day bye